Polite ways to ask for repetition. Mastering, I'm sorry, I didn't catch that. Hello everyone, welcome back to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to be diving into the world of conversational English and focusing specifically on asking for repetition in a polite way. Our highlight phrase for today is, I'm sorry, I didn't catch that. Remember, clear communication is essential in any conversation, and knowing how to ask for clarification is an important part of this. Firstly, let's understand what the phrase, I'm sorry, I didn't catch that, means. It's a polite way of saying that you did not understand what the other person said. You're basically requesting them to repeat or clarify what they've just said. This phrase is commonly used in both informal and formal situations. Now, let's learn how to use this phrase. I'm sorry. I didn't catch that, is usually used as a standalone sentence, in response to something someone else has said. The key is to say it with a polite tone, to express your genuine request for them to repeat what they've said. Here are a few examples. Person 1. The meeting is scheduled for 3 p.m. tomorrow. Person 2. I'm sorry, I didn't catch that. When is the meeting? Variety is the spice of life and language is no exception. Here are some other phrases you can use to politely ask someone to repeat themselves. I'm sorry, could you say that again? I beg your pardon, what was that? I'm sorry, I didn't get that. Pardon me, could you please repeat that? Remember, these phrases are all interchangeable and have the same meaning as, I'm sorry, I didn't catch that. And that's a wrap on today's lesson. We hope that you now feel more comfortable asking for clarification in English. Remember, there's absolutely nothing wrong with not understanding something the first time around. And using phrases like, I'm sorry, I didn't catch that, can help ensure you fully understand the conversation. We're glad you joined us for today's lesson, and we look forward to seeing you in the next one. Until then, Keep practicing.